Hello everyone, and in this video I'm going to show you how to add Unity ads to your game. First of all, I must admit that the ads are working only for mobile platforms. So from the two platforms you have to select your own. So I use Android and you can use also iOS. And switch to this platform or this one. Then you will need to go to Window, Asset Store and search for Unity Ads Asset. You just type here Unity Ads and press enter and uh, download and import uh, this package from Asset Store. Then you will need to create a special script which will show your ads. In my case I use C Sharp because C Sharp is uh, you know this you, this um, servers this package is using C sharp you know this namespace so I created also C sharp script and in this C sharp script we have very important stuff here so this is namespace it's very important it's like a very important component for the system to work and this is name of our script this is application ID so I have it in string in public mode because I want be uh, I want to be able to change it in inspector so not to go to script not to edit this script again so I have it available through my inspector this is my app ID then in start function in void I mean I'm still <laughs> using JavaScript so sorry for I mean not 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 function uh, void so we hey we have here you know this line so like you know hey Unity adds. This is my app ID. We, you know, we register application ID here. So we say, hey, this is my app ID, and this is mode of uh, advertisements we are going to use. So this is for test mode. So if it's true, that then we are testing this as. If not true, so we are not testing. So be careful with this one, because look, if you don't have this test mode enable it if you have it you know this value uh, false then you are going to run into trouble so you are going to inflate your own views you're gonna make your fake views of advertisements and obviously you will be banned from this service so be careful if you're going to use this for test uh, use this value true here or also you can go to mm, this um, Servers. This is where you get this uh, app ID. And uh, actually, how to get this app ID, right? So you have to go to your Unity Ads uh, account, which can be created, which created thanks to your Unity account. So if you have your U Unity account uh, already created, so you just use your login and your password and you have it you go to games you click here add new game select your platform I use Android so I select this and uh, here you set the name of I mean uh, the mm, link to your package or name of your package so the package is the game available on store or, or on market so it's all ready published game if your game is not published yet, you just click here, uh, type any you know random name for your game, and click here Add Game, and you will get your game in this list. And you know this game will have this ID, which is this one, in my case, and your platform and this switch, you know, to monetize or not to mon or not to monetize, just like on YouTube, you know, this AdSense. You click here. And you have here, you know, this option, um, show advanced, and you have here, you know, this add test mode. So in my case, it's uh, like, you know, it's set in script, so in script. If I have this one true in script, so it will use this uh, option. So, mm, but uh, if you uh, ship your game, with this value <laughs> over here so you can go to this wonderful uh, settings and change it you know to 
uh, force off. So if even somewhere in your code you have this true, if you change this uh, note to force off, it will make all your you know test advertisements uh, real. So also be careful also with this value. So so for instance, if you have this true over here and you are sure that you know. I have you know test advertisements. I'm you know safe, and here you have uh, you know the uh, force off. So you will also run in trouble, and you will be <laughs> banned from service. So you know keep your eyes you know over here and over here. It's very important. And we are going to another very important part. So look, uh, mm, Unity ads they are working you know at once. So you know, uh, you say you know show ads and they are shown. But if ads are not ready, you know for show, uh, so there will be error. I mean error, you know, like this. You know this and this. And to make Unity be ready to show the ads, you have to wait. So look here. Here we have this enumer enumerator. So. Uh, to prepare our ads, so if r if uh, advertisements are not ready, so if Unity is not found my ad, then we wait and let uh, Unity ads to find our ad, and then if uh, ad is ready to show, we show it, and we put this over here. Then actually, that's all. Actually, the you know that's all about the stuff I have only one game over here and I have zero zero over here and l and now <laughs> I'm going to test it for the first time ever so let's just have a look at this uh, let's just hit the play button I'm not sure maybe it's not gonna work but let's have a look let's have a look at our it's not gonna work, it's not gonna work, it's not gonna work, it will fail, I know. God damn it. Please, why it takes so long? It takes so long, it will fail, it will fail, oh my god, no. What's going on, I have no idea, it's... <gasps> it's working! It's working. Here would be your ad unit. The things, this, you know, things seems to be working great. It's working. You, yeah, yeah, yeah. So now you know how to make it work, guys. Thanks for watching this video. Have a good time. Bye bye. Bye bye. And have a good time. See you later in the next video of something very interesting or maybe not not very interesting. Bye bye.